Hey you guys, welcome back to this channel. My name is Karen Madash. To those who don't have me already on social media, get connected down in the description below. Um, please subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And today I'm gonna be using this um, Modern Renaissance from Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. And this is gonna be my first time reviewing it and showcasing to you my own glitter glam um, using this palette. Um, I'll definitely give you guys an honest review on this, and so far, well, just keep watching. Do things when you want me to, like control that, control. Okay, so after I moisturized, did my eyebrows, did all that great stuff, I'm gonna be using this stick foundation from Makeup Forever um, Ultra HD in this shade 125. Go slow. Now I'm going to take my Real Techniques Beauty Blender to blend everything through. Yeah, uh, last time I sang in Spanish, now I'll hit a verse. I'm trying to kill the game, better get a hearse. Your body's so flame, you never needed propane. I'm about to start calling you Rihanna for putting me to work. Work, 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 work. I love the way you look when you're rocking my shirt. Especially when you move like controller, you're going fast. I'm going to use my Maybelline concealer. This is in the color Fair Claire. And I'm going to be using my Pro Concealer in the color Toast to highlight and contour my face. So I'm going to take this Real Techniques Beauty Blender and I'm going to blend in all the highlight areas. Then when I'm done with that, I'll go ahead and use the color Toast uh, Concealer uh, to contour my cheekbones, temples, and nose. I don't know how to talk to you. I don't know how to ask you if you're okay. My friends always feel the need to tell me things. Okay, you guys, it's time to contour. These days, I don't know how to talk to you. I don't know how to be there when you need me. It feels like the only time you see me is when you turn your head to the side and look at me differently. And last night, so I'm going to take the bottom of this beauty blender and I'm going to start sculpting my face. But I'm going to be using my air spun and the same beauty blender and I'm going to be baking with my under eye and all the highlight areas of my face. I don't know how to talk to you. I just know I found myself in lost for you. So whatever is here is what I'm going to use. I'm going to use my damp beauty blender. I'm going to use the bottom. And I'm just going to pick up all that. Then you can go over lightly over the contour area. Ooh, you. 
Wait about two to three minutes so everything can set in and then with a big powder brush we'll take it off. Okay, so I waited about two to three minutes to let everything set in together. Now I'm gonna use a big powder brush. Um, you can use a fan brush if you like. I'm gonna be using the Morphe M400. Don't you open up that window Don't you let out that anecdote So now I'm gonna bronze the face and I'm gonna be using CoverGirl Medium Intro and it's a beautiful color, it's a beautiful bronze. I'm gonna be using this stippling brush and I'm gonna define my cheeks and bronze everything up. Don't you let out that anecdote Party on a Sunday Do it all again on Monday Spin a check on a weekend I might do it all again I just hit a three-peat With three girls I met this So now I'm gonna take the NYX primer base um, for my eyes to start off this look so I'm going to take this um, Modern Renaissance um, palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I'm going to be using a fluffy brush. So I'm going to be using as my brown shade here in the crease. Um, this is called Burnt Orange. It's right here. So I'm also going to dive into the Morphe brushes palette because I'm so in love with it as well. Uh, I'm going to take these two colors, like all these four, this whole row here, I'm just going to mix it in and I'm going to also add it onto my crease. Okay, so from this palette, I'm going to go ahead and use this beautiful red color. It's called um, Venetian Red. And so I'm going to use that to intensify my crease a little bit more. So far, this palette and these colors are pigmented, like very blendable. And honey, okay. Now I'm gonna carve my cut crease. Uh, I'm gonna carve this whole thing so that every, everything could look sharp and beautiful. I'm gonna be using the NYX uh, primer lid base. And I'm gonna be using this flat brush. Now I'm going to be applying this gold shade in the middle of my lid and out. Um, and it's called um, Primavera. I'm gonna jump right in into the Morphe palette and I'm gonna go ahead and use these colors right here to intensify my inner corner here. Where's a makeup look without glitter? We're definitely going to be adding some beautiful Bella Terra glitter in the color Ignol. Take your duo lash glue, apply some on your hand. Use any brush, um, this part, and just start dabbing the glue. 
onto your lid. Of course you're gonna experience a little bit of fallout and that's why we have the loose powder so that after this whole look is done then we can swipe away all the powder and voila you don't have anything damaged under, under so the now it's time to do the liner um, I'm gonna be using these two products here this is they're both from black radiance this one's more of a marker and then this one's more liquid and so I use both to help me out with this um, glitter look. So first I'm going to be using the liquid one. Take the marker and I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna make it longer. Nobody makes it from my ends. I had to bust up the silence. So now I'm gonna be using the Wet n Wild um, mascara. This is the Mega Impact. And I'm gonna be applying a generous coat of this onto my lash. They are my own De donde llegaste ni pregunté. Lo único que sé es que quiero con usted. Now taking a flat brush like this, we're gonna go ahead with this pink color. It's called Love Letter. Um, I'm going to apply this on the lower lashes. To highlight my face, I'm gonna go in with Mica Beauty. This is shimmery powder. Um, I'm going to use this as my highlighter and it's in 28. I'm using this fan brush to apply it. So whatever's on the top here, that's exactly what I'm going to use. Now for the finishing touches, I'm going to be applying this matte lip color by LA Girl, and it's called Stunning. Oh, it's just me, myself, and I, solo right until I die, cause I got me for life. all right you guys this concludes my love for this palette the anastasia beverly hills modern renaissance palette has been so amazing to me very first time i'm trying it i'm so happy that i laid my hands on it i had to play around with it a couple of times and so far it's slang the game it's lit if you guys fell in love with this makeup look, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below for an update on how... Comment down below. I love to read everyone's comments on what they have to say. I'll definitely see you guys later. Bye. My just changed.